which is a very simple. Yeah, there's next got to be some you, hardware, right? Little oh, okay. audio edge device, uh, single cable from that, so that's power over Ethernet. So these these four microphones and the four headphones all plug into that one box, and then everything to turn this into a complete radio and production studio is done in software on a virtual machine. Whenever you have any need for anything 2110 uncompressed media, this is the guy. Yeah, and what I'm really excited about is not only the technical aspects of ST2110 and all that needs to be accomplished on that side, but I'm really excited about the production aspects. Allion is a multiple luggage and equipment case company. We do aluminum and ABS plastic for different applications. We have a single color Fresnel at $695 US, full bicolor with the Portable driver dimmer, bi color, yep. runs on battery, comes with a four pin D tap cable, 40 watts drive. That's it, 40 right. watts. And we're previewing the Arcadia. So, in the first time, you have digital wireless and digital party line wired systems all connected together in one system under Arcadia, or all under, under central control under CCM. Uh, Aries coming out with a new battery mount called the B mount. Yep. Uh, so, we're going to offer an option or a solution for that. Uh, we're offering two capacities, a 98 watt hour and also a uh, 147 watt hour. What we're demonstrating here is um, KVM over IP. It's over a single gigabit ethernet. Okay. Uh, we support uh, dual screens as well as single screen remote stations. And at the same time, we also support a video wall functionality. The accessories of all accessories for the Ninja 5 okay. and the Ninja 5 Plus. So it's a really integrated solution for using the expansion port on the back of the Ninja. Yep. And then it clips on in a, in a modular way to create what clearly looks like a fully formed integrated product. Mm. We're working with Trackit to demonstrate how interoperation can work in the cloud. How they are showing how they can use AWS Nimble to move files up to the cloud efficiently and effectively and how we can plug all of these things in together in a heterogeneous environment using open standards so we could be the things delivering the ingests as we are today and someone else can be doing the play out and the MAM because it's always much better when you all just play together. We're standing in front of the Colorec Brio here. This, uh, this fits in, in just beautifully um, ergonomically, yeah, it's a Calric, you know. Yeah. So a lot of smaller trucks use, you know, many different consoles. Most A ones, they're obviously much happier with the Calric. If you are into esports or esports broadcast, which many of you, I'm sure, are, the device that you've been looking for may well be here. It's the Glen Sound GTM. The the pots on the top, these are just uh, the inputs to the headphones. So these are the, the headphone channels, the game, the team mix and me, their own voice. NAB 2022 is a very special uh, year for us. Um, we've received an Emmy for our EZTV platform and the revolutionary technology of distribution and management of IPTV content in news and media facilities. Our ENGO 3X is our next generation ENGO transmitter with 5G capabilities. It also has 4K and four inputs. So you can now have four SDI inputs into a single unit for transmitting the video. We can bring in content from WhatsApp, Telegram, SMS, email, and other messaging platforms. And what that means is that the broadcaster or the content creator can tap into all of these channels, get the content coming in, moderate it, and make sure that the best comments are seen on the screen. And that then helps to enrich their broadcast. It helps them to have a conversation with the audience while things are happening. So what we have initially is an, an unveiling of the QXP here, which is a, a brand new um, form factor for, for fabrics. This is the, the portable QXL. So it's a QXL in a portable chassis. He has a gorgeous seven inch integral LCD screen. Here you can see this is VTRAC 1008. This is equipped with NVMe caching and SSDs for boosting the NAS performance. Uh, you, may, you may ask me the question, why NAS? Because Promise is well known for DAS solutions. Yeah. And this is in fact true, but also it's not. Because Promise has been doing NAS solutions for a long time and very experienced in the area as well. And we really know uh, what the rich media customers need. So this is why we came up with VTRAC answers right here. And AI is sort of embedded, invisible in the supply chain. Yep. And and we're bringing that in the context of a supply chain automation software called Clear. 
Metro. And that's sort of really where, where we say Dr. Broad AI led supply chain automation. Okay. And this is brand new for NAB this year? That's right. This okay. this construct of sort of this becoming invisible yeah. in the context of what we call AI everywhere okay. in the supply chain. Okay. That's really new, brand new. Is our LV5600 and the LV7600 and its ability to be able to be controlled via NMOS. I've got a 3840 by 2160 UHD program coming in and a control panel here that is tied to NMOS and we can see that as soon as I push a button how quick the video changes. And this is actually coming from Hanover now is it, in Germany? Yeah, that's the, the whole essence of what we're doing. There's some demos further down the line which are using uh, Amazon Web Services Cloud. All of these demos are using our remote connection into Hanover in Germany and very low latency connection using uh, SRT and NDI for different parts of the chain. We are very excited about Blue Pill and Blue Pill Inside. So Blue Pill is actually a hardware product like this. This is a standalone version of Blue Pill. It's a server platform that offers ease of use, a lot of power and modularity to our controllers. The unit itself, it's nice, but it's a four channel Dante based intercom unit. And the thing about it is, it was designed to help fill out our line of Dante intercom products. Okay. So I like the product, but really it's more representative of what we do in responding to the needs of our customers. We would like to present you our new Sumo Max Lite, okay. which we show for the first time in, in the US. Okay. It's brand new. It's a 700 watt uh, fixture that is very powerful with um, 20,000 lux output at three meters. Okay. Um, it also has 19 pixels that you can individually control. Here showing some more of our new products within uh, our probing, monitoring, and multi-viewing uh, software. Uh, the big one here is our MCS product where we have the ability to now configure multiple systems um, from a centralized location across multiple different locations as well. What we're talking about here predominantly is something called Stream Studio. So that is a full live production solution in the cloud. It includes an AME production switcher. It has graphics. It has a slow-mo replay engine. Uh, it has full talkback, 64 channel yeah. audio mixer. Yeah. So it's pretty much everything it's that you yeah. need. So the Tally TM1, key benefits top line, $7,500. It's half the price of a full fledged Tally Man system. Second thing is, it can work in conjunction with the whole spectrum of other TSL control system devices. All of our fly packs are 110 or 220 volt switchable automatically. Okay. So they'll work anywhere in the world, 50 hertz, 60 hertz. Uh, the screens go down for transport. Oh, that's clever. So they're highly, highly mobile. So uh, really, uh, you know, uh, we are answering to uh, uh, complex RFPs. And thanks to our broad portfolio of, uh, of products, we are able to address such end-to-end -end solution, you know, bringing Perhaps bringing player, bringing our backend and all security, uh, content security solutions. Our products now accept both bot and cellular inputs okay. as well as our traditional Coftum. Wow. The Link Matrix, which is the operating system of Mobile Viewpoint now, controls every single product, whether it was a historic VisLink product. And then uh, we uh, introduced last year our 5G capability combined with our Coftum capability, mm -hmm. which we demonstrated at first at um, um, the British Grand Prix. EditShare Flex is our, our cloud, uh, new cloud solution uh, and it brings together workstation management so you can log into remote workstations, e edit on them with your favorite editing um, applications like Adobe Premiere or uh, DaVinci Resolve. You can connect through to our uh, media asset management flow and to our uh, storage and that's all uh, wrapped up into a, a package that's very easy to use. I think really our history in ATSC uh, back from the original ATSC 1.0 all through today, we have many years of history of how these systems integrate, and our ATSC3 lab has really helped us to learn the new standard and right. be compatible with the, the new equipment on the market. When we have here this uh, new interlocking system, for example here, we have right now uh, the adapter which would match onto the Q5, but you can uh, also take it away, and uh, then we can take uh, for example, here the non-lux adapter, but you just 
attach on it. So it clicks and snaps in, and then you can also rotate it. This allows us to take a look at any metadata a customer might want and put that into the calculation of who is the best fit for this, what is the best fit, or more importantly, give me a series of large-scale scenarios for how I schedule my thousand people. It's our first step into machine learning and certainly the, the precursor into moving AI into the platform. We have the new 44 series headset. So this is a 4466, which is an Omni version. We have yep. a 4488, which is directional. So we basically took our existing five millimeter capsules yep. and put them on the new uh, Red Dot award-winning headset design that we made. Um, kind of the marriage of, of old and new. And I want to introduce you to our new personal workplace controller. Uh, this is basically a multi-viewer, up to 26 inputs. Um, that gives you full KVM control. Uh, that gives me the flexibility to operate real-time several devices. I have a primary workspace and I can be watching for alarms or errors elsewhere here. We're showing live production in the cloud, which is all of the tools that you need for a live production in the control room completely virtualized. Yeah. And you could have it, because it's virtualized, you could have it locally on-prem or you can have it up in the cloud. So it gives you that complete freedom that you need for being able to do your day-to-day -day productions or spinning up for new broadcast or doing things like remote production, sporting events all over the world. I'm showing off the CV730 BHN. So this camera is very flexible and interface, has a eight and a half megapixel 4K sensor. So that's a 4K60 with 30X optical zoom. Kind of our flagship camera and it will market for roughly six and a half thousand dollars. Moses is a pioneering inventor and manufacturer of virtual production technology solutions, remote production and image robotics. They're providing the LED content server and the remote heads for this presentation. Halo Vision is a surround and immersive visual analysis suite. Yep. So it has various different views uh, which allow you to kind of analyze uh, any audio up to 712 channels in various different ways. We've got brought two brand new products to market here for the show. They are open gear cards that address basically the transmission of SDI to optical, so it's one of our okay. FIDO cards. We added the very first software based license um, to support Dante Audio. 12G okay. SDI bridge to Dante Audio. Mm -hmm. Of course, with the increasing um, number of audio channels, yeah. um, audio over IP uh, comes in very handy. So what we have here is our brand new ATSC3 uh, signaling server, which is the first in an open gear form factor. So with this card now, when you take your existing ATSC1 multiplexer here, and want to upgrade the ATSC3 signaling server, all you do is request a license key from us, we send it to you, you reboot the system, you now have your signaling server. In our open gear platform, the flagship device is the OG4600 series card we see here. It's also uh, de depicted here on this graphic, talking to a large portion of our portfolio. Don't forget to check everything out we've been doing on the show floor at our playlist, which is on YouTube and kitplus.com. We've been here all week uh, shooting videos as we have been doing for the last 12 years of 13 years of shit of what I don't care. Let's try again. And we're here with, I've forgotten your name straight away. Oh. And we're here at NAB 2022. <laughs> We've been using a camera that I can't remember the name of because we only need a cutaway. With this person here, I'm going to talk some shit because I have no idea what I'm saying. We're now outside in a truck. Well, we're inside in the truck, outside in a truck. We're outside in a truck in the outside broadcast. No, now it's DC. I was all going well at the first bit. NAB 2020, 2020, 2022, and two and 2022. It really has. It's, it's been a long time. I've just materialised here from the Starship Enterprise. <laughs> we just need a, a stellar about what we're doing at Kitplus.com. <laughs> Sorry. Would we burst again? Always do it with you. Every single time. Why? Bossy, I think is the word. And we are in, yeah, we're in NAB, believe it or not. NAB 2022 again, and uh, no, we're not here again. No, <laughs> we haven't been here for a while at all. <laughs> a number of, mul of, oh, of multi dime videos. It's not a number of multi dime videos. I've already forgotten the name. I'm going to start again. What was it? Gordon, isn't it? Gordon. Yeah, that's right. We're not from the suburbs of Chicago at all. No, we've got 5,000 miles from England. You're going to go again from the top.
You can't hide that. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Yeah. And <laughs> Stuart Russell, I'm going to do that again. Good, I was going to call you Russell. So what does Tally Man do, Simon? I'm going to interview you now. <laughs> 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 outside, in a truck, well we're inside, in the truck, outside, in a truck, we're outside, in a truck, in the outside.